We're going to see you again throughout the show. You've got some great things coming up in about 40 minutes. Yep, I'll see you then. Okay. Take care, everybody. Enjoy. <laughs> you can keep shopping 766 Six four seven is the item number on the umbrellas. Now I want to share with you some more things that we've got coming up in our show of spring garden preview. And if you're just joining us, welcome. You're watching HSN. Uh, we are looking here at the Idea Works two-in-one garden folding seat and the kneeler. This is always very popular, and I dare say very needed for most of us because we're showing it to you when you are gardening instead of sitting on the ground, sitting in the dirt or on the grass. But really, you can use this folding seat in so many places, like when you are, no guys said he uses it when he's washing the car. Um, maybe when you are doing some painting, some paint projects around your home, and you want to get those baseboards, and you don't want to sit on the ground to do it. Maybe when you're doing plumbing projects around your home. This is something that you can use in so many different places. And we've got it for you at a customer pick and at a great sale price where we took $10 off the price. In purple, green, or gray are your choices. This one holds up to 250 pounds. We do have an extra large one that holds up to 400 pounds, but they work the same way. And we'll give you the full uh, details on those coming up in just a few moments. And also, um, if you're saying, well, I, you know, I love being outdoors, but I've got some areas that are a little bit unsightly. What can I do? Well, you can, you can disguise them. You can cover them with the Improvements Expandable Fence with leaves. So this is the deal. You're gonna choose whether you want the, gr the purple that you see right there. We've got um, yellow, orange, or white. So you're gonna get the green leaves and then either purple, yellow, orange, or white in terms of a little bit of color that's interspersed in there. But you just expand it and open it up. And now you can have blockage from whether it's a, a trash can you don't wanna see or an air conditioning unit, or maybe you have a balcony that you want to conceal, um, you know, from the folks below. And you can have what looks like a beautiful ivy-covered fence. We'll show you, you can read the reviews if you're near hsn.com right now, but we took about $5 off the price, and I love that we've got all four options for you right now. So that's coming up closer to the end of the show, but if you don't wanna wait, as always, you can go ahead and pick that up now, 682301. So we're talking um, our spring garden preview. And I love when we've got easy things that we can add to our outdoor. And that's where the um, Maxa motion activated outdoor LED wall sconces come into play. You're getting two of them because you can't just have one sconce. So, so I love that you're getting a two pack. These are motion activated, which most sconces aren't. Most sconces are wired into the wall and you have to flip a switch to turn them on. These are motion activated. We've got them for you in copper. We have them in white and also in black. We took um, about $10 off of our regular HSN price. You even have flex pay about $16 to get these home. And Matt Davis is joining us, Matt, with all of the details. Hello, my friend. Good morning, Miss Tamara. I'm, I'm so excited to be here this morning. Uh, I know a lot of us are thinking about outdoors. If you live down here in Florida, you're thinking about your backyard, your front yard, and you're thinking about how to make it more beautiful. And maybe you're also thinking about security. Well, we've solved all those problems today with the Maxa two-pack of wall sconces. These have been so popular at HSN, incredible quality and real beautiful wall sconces. Now these are motion activated. So these are going to come on whenever they see motion and it's dark outside. It gives you those three S's, Tamara. We always talk about three S's. Number one, safety. So when you walk up to the front door, these lights are gonna come on automatically, no trips and falls, right? Number two, security. So maybe you're inside watching your favorite hostess ever at HSN, Miss Tamara <laughs> Hooks, and all of a sudden the light comes on outside. Hey, somebody's here or something is here, something's moving within 30 feet and the lights are gonna come on automatically. So that's security, right? Then we talk about the most important S, style. It looks beautiful. So this is to flank your front door, your garage door. Maybe it's a side yard that's a little dark. You can place these out there. There are no wires to run, no electricians to call. 
No expensive installation. With two screws, you can place these just about anywhere. They are battery powered. You're gonna put four C-cell batteries in each unit, but don't panic. The folks at Max have thought of everything. They're using LED technology. So you're not gonna to have to change the batteries. Maybe once a year on average use, you're gonna to have to change out those batteries. But that way you're not up and down the ladder. You never change out a bulb. These are really your worry-free lighting solution. And Tamara, yes. uh, again, this value at HSN, only at HSN can you get the two-pack today at this incredible value. I mean, it really is. And when you consider that these can go anywhere, think about all the places that you would love to have light. Um, and not only light, light in when you need it. Like you said, motion activated so that you're not walking up in the dark, right? Um, these are motion activated so you can see I've got the motion on. Let me make sure it's on all of them as I walk in front. And you can see all of the lights are on and it gives you a beautiful bright glow. It may look a little blue on your screen because sometimes that's what um, TV cameras can do. But when you get it home, you'll see that it is a clean white light. And what's fantastic about these is that these are 12 inches high, six inches wide, seven inches long, and they're easy. And I, I, you know, I think for a great price like this, how could you go wrong? Um, you know, Matt, we're showing installation right there. You choose to put them where you don't currently have light and where you would like light and beauty because I know for, you know, sometimes we want things to be functional, but they also have to be beautiful at the same time. <laughs> that's, ex that's exactly right, Tamara. This is, I brought the old, the old fashioned, if you want a motion light, It right? looks like a bullhorn. My, wi my wife is in the room. She's over here laughing because <laughs> she knows if, if I brought this home and said, honey, I'm going to put this in the front yard yes. uh, for motion, she'd say, uh, no, you're not. Think, <laughs> to, think twice. <laughs> because this is this looks like a prison yard or something, right? <laughs> and you have to wire it, and you have to call an electrician, and you get to, you know, or you get to try to crawl around up in the attic and run these wires. Well, no, I'm not doing that. You know that. <laughs> these are po actually on two four-by-four four posts that I mounted here, and all this is two screws, so you can do it yourself. This is a true DIY project. And again, you're putting light where you need it the most. Maybe you have a fence line in the backyard and you wanna get a couple sets. So when you let the dog out, the lights will come on automatically. Or maybe this is by the front door or the side door. And yeah, if you want to, you can split them up. Put one by one side door and one by the side door by the garage. These are also something you could take with you. So maybe you're renting. Mm -hmm. You could put these outside of your house, take two screws out and take them with you when you're done renting. Again, the gorgeous look of these beautiful lights from Maxa. I mean, if you saw these and you walked up to a home, you would say the architect really made a good choice, right? Yes. Putting these beautiful sconces out there. This is not something that's ugly, but it's incredibly functional. And again, mm -hmm. motion activated, so they're gonna come on only at night and they're gonna only come on when they see something out there. Right. Safety, it welcomes you home. Yes. security it tells you when somebody or something is out there moving around and style they look beautiful day and night only from the folks at Maxa. Again, you're getting a two-pack at this value. Crazy, That's right. crazy value. It really is. And I mean, and you said it right there. I mean, they are beautiful. They are when when you need them. Like you said, it's motion activated. So they come on when you are out there. I like you mentioned, you know, when you have to take the dog out at night, um, you know, to do their business. When you are, you know, walking in certain parts of your home and you need lights, not just that you want it, it's that you need it. That's what this is. A lot of you are calling in for the copper the the copper is most popular and the copper is most limited as well we only have a few hundred um, remaining in no, copper okay it. and i hope i hope that we would be able to get some back but i've i've got them for you now right here in the copper we also have them in white and remember you're getting a two pack we're just showing you one here but you would get two and then we also have them for you in black and if you're thinking okay i want to go ahead and give those a try Call us or shop on hsn.com to pick them up. Um, you'll see how easy they are to use. And this is what's going to happen, Matt. And tell me if, I'm, if, if you agree. You're going to get them home. You're going to put them up. You're going to love them. And you're going to say, now I need more. <laughs> now I wish I had some for <laughs> that shed. I wish I had from, some for the back of the garage or what have you. That's a, that's a great point. And, and just like you said, think about all those ideas. Take a mental inventory. Think about, I'm walking around the outside of my house. 
where is that dark corner that you always kind of think about, right? Put a couple out there. You can put them, again, just about anywhere on the outside of the house. They're going to look beautiful. And again, they're not this ugly motion detect. I mean, these do a good job, okay? They scare people away for security. But other than that, during the day, they look terrible, right? Well, these are going to look beautiful wherever you place them. Again, maybe it's a fence line or maybe it is a shed where there is no electricity. Mm -hmm. I, I have a good friend, Julie Truster. You know, Julie? Yes. She has an, a shed that has no electricity in her backyard. Well, guess what? Place these lights out there. Now the lights come on automatically. You don't have to call an electrician. There's no wires to run. This is the simple solution. But whoever thought that simple solutions like this mm -hmm. with the LED technology would be this beautiful? I mean, right. at the end of the day, you want your home to look great and be functional? Well, this is the solution from the folks at Maxa. I Absolute, love it. Absolutely. Absolutely. We, we do love this. These run on batteries. They run on C batteries, um, four of them. You go ahead and get those. You put these wherever you want them to be, and they are motion activated. In copper, very popular in the copper color, in the white, and also in the black. If you want a few sets, do it while they're on sale. 596024 is the item number there. Matt, thank you so much for bringing these in. Thank you, Tamara. It's great to be here. This definitely, morning. definitely. Um, you can keep shopping for those. I also wanted to share another way for you to have light, and I'm holding on to it here, and you're going to see it in some imagery as well. These are also from Maxa. It's called a post cap and deck railing lights. So these can be mounted on almost any standard four by four or six by six post, uh, fence post right here. These are solar powered. You can see that nice big solar power um, uh, uh, display right there along the top. But these are beautiful if you have an area that you want to have um, light right there along the, 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 pens, the fence. I keep saying <laughs> the, the fence post, <laughs> the fence post. Um, if you have a 4 by 4 which is the way that they are using it there, they took off the base. They literally just lifted the base off and put the light right on top of that. If you have a 6 by 6 um, fence post, then you would utilize the base that comes right along with and place it like this. So this is if you have a 4 by 4 and then this is the base that comes along with. You pop that on and then you would use that if you have a 6 by 6 fence post, all right? And it's a two pack um, in your choice of black, bronze, or white. Those are always very popular as well. And I will tell you, do not, do not miss out on that sale price. Let's move on to what I consider a must have. And whether you're in the garden, whether you're doing projects around the house, whether it's just for when you're washing the car, you need a way to comfortably be in some um, kneeling positions. And that's where the idea works, two-in-one garden folding seat and kneeler come in. So you can use it in two different ways. You can flip it one way when you wanna kneel all the way down and have that cushion under your knees. Or you can flip it the other way when you just want to have a seat. Maybe you're doing some work in that position. This is about 19 inches high, about 23 inches long, and about 9 inches wide. This can hold up to 250 pounds. If you want one that can hold a little bit more, we do have an extra large version. Works exactly the same way. And the extra large can hold up to 400 pounds. But I want you to give us a listen. Choose your color of purple gray or green and take advantage of the sale price for uh, five flex of four dollars i promised you chad allen would be back and chad you're back with a huge customer pick <laughs> yeah one of my favorites every season is the garden kneeler we don't do it very often because um well we run out quite frankly <laughs> but for, for spring and fall is really the only two chances I get to present this amazing item. So uh, what is it? It comes to you completely uh, flat, like just like this. And then you get to choose whether you want kneeling or uh, seated position. It, it all, it's all the same item. So it just converts and transforms uh, and works with you. But here's the big thing. We go outside to garden, to plant, to do all the things. And our knees are on the rock, on the soil, on the grass, on the mulch. And then it not only gets our, our, our knees dirty, but it also doesn't feel so great. So after five or six minutes, we're like, oh, I gotta get up, I gotta move around. 
and then I have nothing to sort of like get up to and how do you get up off the ground, et cetera. So anyway, the garden kneeler fixed all of that several years ago when we launched it. I'm able to put my knees elevated up off the ground onto two layers of EVA foam, the same sort of foam that's in running shoes to absorb the shock. It has a clearance here, and you can see my hand completely slides back and forth underneath, giving you a little bit of height. So if there is rock or gravel or grass, it isn't gonna push directly down onto that. It has some height there as well. So if I put my knees on this, oh wow, now it's a lot more comfortable. Having my knees on foam rather than hard surface is a lot better. And then there's these oversized handlebars, okay? And these, don't sleep on these. These are a game changer because I'm able to use my hands and grab on. So instead of using my knees, my hips, and my back, I can use my arm strength to get myself up off the ground. Same thing on the way back down. If I want to get down to that level, if I can bend over and I can grab these, then I can use my arm strength again. I can position myself and then slowly, easily, gently get myself down to the ground instead of just like, you know, sort of falling to the ground and catching myself. It does flip over very easily, holds up to 250 pounds. So it becomes a full garden seat. So now I'm able to, Guy Yovan washes his car tires like this, organizing under the kitchen sink, painting the baseboards. And then when you're done with it, I wanna show you this, I'll get a little bit closer. Right here, there's a bar. So I'm able to pinch that bar. See how, I'll do it from behind, there we go, see? I'm able to pinch that bar and bring it up. And when I do that, the legs fold down. So now I can store it away for the season. I can put it in the trunk. I can put it in the car. So when I go to the tailgate or the soccer game or the football game, mm. listen to this. Here it is. Listen. It locks into place. Yes. Now I have my seat. I can go out there if their bleachers are cold or the, ble <laughs> the bleachers are too firm for me and I want that foam seat. Right. I'll sit off to the sidelines. Here yes. I am on my garden seat, waving everybody, go, go, go. <laughs> <laughs> so Tamara, I mean, this really is really versatile and easy to use at the end of the day. I, I, you can see why everybody loves it. You really can. You can see why it's a customer pick. It literally is that seat when you need the cushion, that support, that comfort, you've got it. And let me show you this. This is what Chad was showing you. When it's all folded up and you're not using it, it folds up to just like this. It weighs about five pounds, but it doesn't even feel like like that and I think it's just because of the way that it's designed so this is it when it's folded and then this is it when it's unfolded uh, that was the green this is the gray this is the purple can I grab this and take this because I want you to see it's no problem moving this around I'm going to put this I'm going to hold on just like Chad said and cushion if I didn't have this I would be on solid this is like wood tile right Solid wood tile, I don't wanna sit on that. I don't wanna kneel on that. There's so many times that whether you're in the garden, whether you're working, like we were talking about doing home projects, maybe it's when you're dealing with the kids, maybe it's when you're organizing you know, certain areas of your home, your closet, your pantry, you're in this position. Wouldn't it be better if you could be comfortable in this position? This is a sale price. We took $10 off. I want you to go for it. On FlexPay, it's $4. But you know what, Chad? This is the kind of piece that becomes priceless once you have it. Yeah, I mean, there's been things on the market in the past. I mean, gardening, gardening is it not, it's not a new trend, right? We've always needed a solution to really do our planting, our gardening. Especially as we get out into the, uh, if, you, if you put in that easy flex, you know, no edge digging like Lou was presenting, if you put that into the ground, there's a million reasons why you could use this, whether it is just an extra seat at the holiday Thanksgiving, um, or you are gardening. So here's how, you know, here's what we were used to. You used to have to buy like these uh, knee pads and you'd strap them onto your knees and these are foam. These, these work, however, they're missing the big handlebars mm -hmm. that allow you to use your arm strength to get up and down. Instead of using your knees, your hips, your back, you can use your arm strength. We all have a little bit of that. So don't get, get rid of those knee pads. And then they came out with like these cheapo little foam things and, and you put it on the ground. And then, I mean, one rock, <laughs> my finger goes right there. One rock, right. I mean, and it's penetrating and it's hitting your knee, whatever, so get rid of those two. Right. This has been a home run because we're talking about real materials, Tamara. This is EVA foam. This is a real two layers of EVA foam on both sides. So both sides has it. And then in between, it is actually sandwiched with uh, with steel to make it really sturdy. And then this, the, the metal that you're seeing on your screen is powder coated steel. 
that means it's good to be weather resistant. So if you are going to use this in the mud or uh, the sleet, the rain, you name it, you can put this in a puddle. It's not going to rust or corrode. That's the kind of seal I'm talking about. And then if you are going to put it down, I want to, I want to, I want you to hear this number one, but I want you to see this because it only weighs a couple of pounds mm -hmm. and hold up to 250. I mean, I can put it on one finger and it's good to go. But as I open it up, when you get this home and you open that box and you go like this, when I hear that sound as a consumer, I go, all right, that's locked into place. I know it's going to hold 250 pounds. So I don't want you to have to worry about it. And then just put it wherever it is. Now, you're probably going to be standing. So let me show you like this, and I'll try to stay in the shot. When you put that on the ground where you need it, get to about this position. And then just, just be safe with it. Take your time. Put your hands here, and then slowly, gently, easily lower yourself down to the ground. Give yourself that assist with these oversized handlebars. The same thing on the way back up. Mm -hmm. Don't try to like grab your knee and press on your knee. That's not good. My mom has uh, two fake knees. I mean, not fake knees, replacement <laughs> knees. No. Uh, they're real in some sense, right? So I don't <laughs> want her pushing on, on her knee like that. Grab the oversized handlebars and then use your arm strength to get back up. And the same thing um, when you're gardening in a seated position, we have these things, Tamara. These are the little um, side carriers. These are available for, as an extra purchase. They're like less than $10. Mm -hmm. They just go right onto the handle. Then I have all my tools that I need, things nice. like that. So there's also some accessories. So if you're a real, if you're really planning on gardening this season, there's some extra things you can pick back up. Right. Don't forget there's that clearance there. So you can put this right on the gravel, the mulch, the grass. You're not going to uh, penetrate that EVA foam that's really sturdy. That's right. And then if I flip it over and I use it as a seat, um, Suzanne Runyon used to talk about how she would keep this because she downsized. She'd keep this um, in her uh, her condo and put her shoes on and off with it. Oh, yeah. So she was able, because yeah, it was a little space by the front door. Yes. So she was able to sit down and actually put her shoes on and off. Guy Yovan talked about cleaning his car tires with it. Right. Danny's taken his and put it in the back of his car. And then when you're done with it, or you want to go to the football game, the soccer game, the baseball game, the tailgate, you name it, yes. you could keep this in the back of your car and then just use it as an extra seat. Then when you get to that game, lock it into place. There's your seat. You want to bend over, have something to lean on to right. organize under the kitchen sink. This could be like your bench to lean on. Right. You could keep all your tools right up here um, and use it as your garden table. Tamara, there's a million ways to use it. And at the end of the day, it's a $20 bill. I know. I mean, and, and can you imagine, can you believe it? I mean, and that's why everybody loves it. That's why it's a customer pick. That's why it's always sells out. Let me share with you. I'm showing it to you in the regular one that we're showing you here at this item number, 715657. It holds up to 250 pounds. And also, if I wanted to scooch over, now it's for one adult. I could probably put my four-year-old on here, but it's really for one adult. We do have an extra large, and I want to just show you size wise if you're thinking because this one holds 250 pounds the extra large can hold up to 400 pounds so just in terms of size difference um, if, if that's what was is the only thing keeping you away you're thinking oh my gosh is it going to be strong enough it, it's strong enough for me but is it going to be strong enough if my husband decides to use it you can see the extra large is a little bit larger it's the same height it's a little bit larger and just a little bit wider in the seat but the main thing is that you've got more surface area and it can hold up to 400 pounds so if you want if you need the extra large one go for it or if you just want one of each because maybe you're going to have one for you know the things that, that hubby does and then one for the things that you do you're good to go you can get it on five flex right so why not go for it but this and i'm going to grab this this is just as easy as we're showing if you want to kneel you flip it one way and i'm kind of flipping it you can it's not heavy so it's easy for you to maneuver if you want to sit you turn it the other way it's that simple and when you want to fold it up you fold it up and throw it into a trunk everybody is going to find at least one if not five uses for this and as you're watching this chad you can see we're approaching a thousand of these ordered and that's just in this presentation these always fly because there are so many different ways you're going to use it you're seeing it there in purple we've got it in gray but by far green is the most popular so if you want green please don't wait on that and chad when you were talking about the fact that this is even in the kneeling position you're not on the ground 
you're not feeling yeah. all of the rocks and all of the, you know, the wet grass or the mud or whatever that's underneath you. You still have that clearance there. It just gives you a lot more comfort when you're using this. Yeah, as we start our spring season, I mean, we usually wear longer pants as we're starting to plant those first couple of plants in, and then you end up getting everything real dirty. You could stay clean while you're gardening. It's a real, it's a real thing. You can put your gloves on, wear your pants. It's going to be okay, but you're going to have a lot more comfort by using the garden kneeler. So instead of being out there for five minutes and not being so happy, now you could probably do a half an hour and be just fine. And then don't forget the safety feature of really being able to use your arm strength to get up and down from the ground whether I'm going down, if I can get to here and slowly, gently, easily lower myself down to the ground. And the same thing on the way back up, grab those oversized handlebars and bring yourself up. And then Tamara, if you are in a small space, those of you who are asking that question, don't forget, just pinch on both sides, those bars, bring those handles down, just weighs about five pounds and holds up to 250. But if you're over 250, as you pointed out, Tamara, mm -hmm. that's okay. Just go ahead and grab that extra large version that right. goes up to 400. Which is so good. You know what? We love this, Chad. We love it. We could spend the whole day just talking about this. Me too. <laughs> this is 733563. That's the item number for, oh, that's the item number for your extra large. If you do want the extra large version that can hold up to 400 pounds, um, please do not wait on that one. Uh, it comes in gray and in green. All right, those are the two choices there, but they work otherwise the exact same way. And so if that one also is a sale price and it's also on five flex of $7.39. Chad Allen, thank you so much. As always, love seeing you. Thank you, okay. Tamara, have a good one. For sure. Now, let me share with you, when you are out in the garden, whether it's that you're gardening or what have you, um, one of the things we wanna stay away from or, or we want to stay away from us are the mosquitoes and the insects that fly out and around. So that's where the Dynatrap comes in. This is an LED half acre mosquito and insect trap. Now we say half acre, meaning because there is one that's larger that can accommodate an acre's worth. Even if you're saying, I don't have a half acre backyard. Okay, most of us don't. But, but what's important is that this one is powerful enough and strong enough to really be able to attract and pull in those mosquitoes and those insects. So the Dynatrap attracts the mosquitoes to it so that the mosquitoes and insects are not attracted to us. We're gonna give you all the details, share with you how it works, but it is on sale. We took $30 off the price. You've got your choice of colors. Uh, this one is stone. We have it in black. This one is bronze. And then here it is in graphite. And um, we're gonna give you all of the details on this. Peter Kilcullen is joining us. Peter, love that we have this early um, so that we can get it home, get it set up and get comfortable with it. And then when those mosquitoes and insects start to come, the Dynatrap is ready for them. Yeah, exactly. And it is definitely early. How are you, Tamara? But um, one of the things that's important to remember is that these mosquitoes, these biting insects, they start to do their thing to, you know, annoy us outdoors just when the temperature gets above 50 degrees. So here in Florida, it's, it's already happening, obviously. But in many other places, it will be happening soon. And this is the perfect thing to have before it's time to say, OK, we want to enjoy the outdoors. What do we have to do to get ready for that with this? You don't have to prepare each and every time you want to go outside. With this, all you're going to do is put it out there. You're going to let it run 24 hours a day. So when you're at work and when you're sleeping and when you're not outside, this is going to be trapping those mosquitoes. So we're not zapping mosquitoes. We're trapping them. And the most important thing to focus on is that LED bulb. That attract the glow bulb is, is amazing. It's scientifically designed to attract those biting insects. So not just mosquitoes, but here in Florida, they're the worst but all those other biting insects and they draw them in. And when they get close, there's a fan, almost like a vacuum that's gonna suck them down into this collection basket where they are no longer gonna bother you and the family when you're trying to be outside. So the technology is amazing. And you're seeing right here, this is true. This bulb will last 27 months. So there's wow. nothing to replace. There's no maintenance. You never even have to think about it being out there for up to 27 months and and emptying this again you don't have to do it for a month or more 
because again, these bugs are take up such a small amount of space. You will love this, that there's no maintenance, that there's nothing to think about, but it is trapping mosquitoes. And what that means is that we are reducing the population of mosquitoes or other biting insects in your yard. Wow. And you see how it does that. Um, we even right. have something special on this product. Normally we have a 30 day return period. This one has a 90 day extended return period because we want you to get it home and start using it and start seeing the way that it's working for you and your family. And this is the deal. When you go to empty the collection basket <laughs> oh it's gonna be filled it's, i mean it's gonna be you know jam-packed with the mosquitoes and the things that didn't come near you and your family and your pets which is fantastic we're gonna go ahead and peter after six days the dynatrap in the we'll look at the half acre after seven days the dynatrap half acre trapped 2500 flying insects it's it's, it's amazing and, and, Tamara, look, I'll show you this. This was something that Dynatrap sent me. This was a couple of weeks in a suburb of Chicago about two years ago. That's what they collected. Oh, my gosh. That's disgusting. Yeah, those are dead bugs. <laughs> I will agree with that, that it is a little disgusting. But think about how amazing that is that you don't have to worry about those insects biting you. But it, we talked about the technology and how it brings them in and then we vacuum them in. But what I love about this is you combine the technology with what Dynatrap's done on how you use it. And here's what I think is so cool about this. So I'm sitting at our outdoor table here, and this is where we'd be eating outside. So we wouldn't have the Dynatrap here. I think you can see it. It's over my shoulder. Where is it? Am I going to go the wrong oh, way? Oh, yes. See, it's back there. See it back there? Yes. That's where you want to put your Dynatrap. So I'm going to put it away from where we're going to be enjoying the outdoors because it's going to take all those mosquitoes, all those biting insects away from where you are. So at least 30 feet away, the perfect height is about three to six feet off the ground. That's kind of the fly area for those biting insects. And what's great about that is now you don't have to wait for the mosquitoes to get near you and then try to repel them, right? So if we're using the sprays or we're using candles on this area where you're enjoying the outside, you're always letting them get so close that they're annoying and then we're trying to repel them. Here, we're gonna attract them away from us and then we're gonna trap them and they are gonna not ruin our fun outside. So this is a great way to be prepared for the outdoors. And the other thing is, as I mentioned at the beginning, when you set it up, like I have the one back here, you're gonna leave it on 24 hours a day. It costs less than two cents a day to run. But think about how it's working all the time. When you spray those chemicals all over you, that's not helping when you're not outside. When you're using those candles, they're only moving those insects away just for a short time. Here, we're going to reduce that population. We're gonna be catching and trapping those breeding insects. You know, the mosquitoes can breed a lot of babies in a mm -hmm. short amount of time. Mm -hmm. So this is reducing that population. And to me, that's all the difference. So as you get into that season, the earlier you start this, the better the season is when we get to July, when we're outside all the time and really enjoying uh, the summer this is a great way to make it enjoyable. Absolutely, and this is what we're talking about. Mosquitoes, flies, wasps, hornets, stink bugs, moths, all of those things that you don't want anywhere near you and your family. And maybe it used to be, have you noticed, you know, some spring and summer after spring and summer, that where the mosquitoes and, and the flying bugs used to not be that big a deal, now you're seeing more and more of them, or maybe you used to not be affected by them the way that now you are. Things just change, time marches on, so now you really see a need for having something like this. So, you know, if you're using and doing other things to try to, you know, keep enjoy the outdoors and keep the insects away from you, and you find that they're just not working the way that you would like them to, I want you to try this while it's on a sale price, because these used to be a lot closer to $100. Today, we took $30 off the price. Remember, you just plug it in away from you and your family, and you turn it on, and you let it run, and you let it do its thing. And that bulb, that new and improved bulb, can last up to 27 months. So keep that in mind as you're shopping for these, that you're not having to replace anything every month or every three months or anything like that. You plug it in and do its job. All you're gonna do is empty that basket. And emptying the basket means you're emptying away 
all of the mosquitoes that didn't have a chance to come into your home to annoy you and your family. You're choosing your color. If you want that shepherd's hook, the way that we're showing it to you there, hung on a shepherd's hook, the way that Peter had his in his home, we even have that adjustable shepherd's hook. And even that is on a sale price as well. And you can get five flex on that shepherd hook as well. So please, and there, there's the item number for the shepherd's hook, 735-820. You've got five flex of under $4 to get that home. So today, all you're doing is choosing whether you want it in the, in the stone color, which is the lightest one. We've got it in black. We also have it in bronze, and then this is the graphite. And um, Peter, when you were showing it in relation to where you and your family sit versus where you have your Dynatrap, that says it all, the fact that you put it as far right. away as possible. So for those folks who are saying, wait a minute, a half acre, I don't have a big half acre. We, I don't want you to get caught up in the size of the acreage or anything. What it's saying is that it is strong enough for you and your family in your backyard. Yeah, exactly. Because if you don't have a half acre, it's going to work even better in that smaller area. And it's independently tested to work, which you were talking about early on. And the great thing is that there's a lot of reasons you don't use other methods to try to repel those biting insects. Maybe it's chemicals. So we have no chemicals. So we have no odors associated with that. This one's on. Very, very quiet. So you're not going to hear anything. And it's super simple to use. I've done all the others, Tamara, where you, every month you have to add more of this and I have to put bait and I have to put something else in there. I mean, maybe a lot of times it's the, I used to have to use the propane tanks and all This is so simple. You don't have to do anything except enjoy being outside. So everything about it, Dynatrap has nailed this technology and made it so simple for you to use. Please go for it. Peter, thank you so much for bringing this to us. Thank you. Always good seeing you. Have a great day, you too. Definitely. And go ahead and pick yours up. 735-815. Take advantage of the $30 sale price, uh, $30 off. Um, we've got a great sale price there and the five flex. Something else I wanted to remind you of, because maybe you saw the presentation, but you missed seeing the item number on that IdeaWorks garden kneeler that we had just a moment ago. Um, very, very popular. Here's the item number. It's 715-657. It's for less than $20. You've got it on FlexPay for $4. You have something that you can use in the garden and pretty much anywhere else and everywhere else. You can use it to kneel on, or you can flip it over and sit on it. It's really that simple. 715-657, you're seeing it there in purple, there it is in gray, but it's very popular in green. So if green is the one you want, I, I would encourage you to go ahead and get it while we have green in stock. Okay, so I know this looks a little bit interesting. I've got rocks. <laughs> But these are from Improvement. These are not real rocks. These are faux garden rocks. These are the kinds of things that you see that are decorative, but also functional. And we're going to talk about that. You've got um, uh, three different options. We've got the 25 inch rock. We have, which um, weighs nine pounds. We have the 18 inch rock that weighs five pounds. And we have the 10 inch rock that weighs 1.7 pounds. See why I call it a faux rock? Because if I wanted to hide something, maybe it is something that has to be out in the garden, but I don't want everybody to see it. Maybe it's a, a utility item or a, or a vent or a manhole cover, I don't, you know, whatever the case is. You now have a decorative and natural looking way to cover those kinds of things. We've got them on FlexPay. Here's the item number 077537. And we're gonna give you all of the details. And I promised you that Deborah Byers would be back and she's gonna be with us for the rest of the show. Um, oh, it's not Deborah. I'm sorry. It's Carrie Mobley. My notes were wrong. I apologize, Miss Carrie. It's so good to see you. Thank you, Tamara. Good morning. Yeah, that's all right. Deborah is wonderful. I wish I could see her again <laughs> as well. But listen, you're so right. You know, I'm a landscape designer. I'm a professional gardener, and I use rocks in my clients' designs all the time. I love these rocks because unlike the real big rocks that you would spend hundreds of dollars on and can never move them, these are durable, they're lightweight, 
They're easy to move and they're realistic. Each one is gonna be a little bit different. I do love the idea of giving up your mat as your hiding place. Under the small <laughs> ones here, I have a thank you note for somebody who might pick up my son uh, and take him to practice. Maybe you have a set of keys because somebody is gonna look after your cats when you're out of town or they just wanna give you a key in case you need to go inside their house. You can do it using this but just lightweight and I also have it kind of nestled in a garden area and I promise spring is coming but they are also decorative the other thing that I like is using them to hide like electrical components um, you know the pipes the meters I'll show you in just a couple minutes I have a sprinkler head that just won't go down but because they're so lightweight and they're easy to move I love them to deter people from possibly coming on your property. In fact, my homeowners association had an issue where we had a curve and everyone kept hitting the grass there. Mm. So they made the genius decision to pop in um, these boulders because listen you can look down for a second but if you see a boulder there you're gonna know I better be careful right <laughs> I like that's you know what these are those kinds of solutions that sometimes just saying oh watch out for the grass oh watch out for the grass no 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 no. this is better you know people will see it and it looks like they belong that's what I love about them they look like they belong there it doesn't look like anything's out of place but think about especially for the big one the 25 inch think about how much you could actually conceal if you need to on them. We've got them on a clearance price and there is flex pay. So I encourage you to get a few of them because Carrie, as you're showing us, you've got a few of them around your garden. I do. I actually have them everywhere. And my husband is really big about wanting things to look kind of put together. I'm an artist, I say, Tamara, so I always have things a little bit ha haphazard. But for example, I have this sprinkler head that I'm hiding here because darn it, I don't know why it just won't go down. So this way I can still have something attractive that gives an architectural beauty, you know, an organic look to the house while it's still concealing something. So if you have those electrical components maybe you have a stump that you just couldn't get rid of this would be a great option to hide that the other thing I have under here how about extension cords oh. if you have let's say any outdoor lighting and you don't want it to be shown when people are really enjoying that outdoors you simply grab one and pop it over now this is the medium size uh, that I have here and this is the large size and I kind of want to bring it up close to you um, just so you can kind of see the detail and each one will be a little bit different um, but I think it just has such a real realistic look to it. it this one the big one it only weighs nine pounds so it's really lightweight so you can change it right you can figure out where you want to put it maybe you're having a get together so you want it you know on the side yard where you hang out but then most of the time you have people who are kind of coming up close to your mailbox and you want to protect it. Mm -hmm. I promise you throwing a boulder there will work. So I just love them. I think they're wonderful. You can, you know, pop them into your landscape. And if you have an area of your garden or of your yard that things just won't grow there, mm -hmm. this is a great way to add some beauty, to add some texture and some style, and nobody will know what is hiding underneath it. I think it's brilliant. Carrie, thank you for those ideas. I love the idea of hiding the extension core too. I'm like, oh, yes. I've got to do that. I've got to do it. Maybe even the water hose. Of course. <laughs> thank you so yes, much. That's a Carrie. great one. Yes. <laughs> Have a great weekend, Tamara. Thank you. Nice to see you. You too. And you can keep shopping. I think these are really great, great options. 077537 for the 25 inch, the 18 inch, or the 10 inch. All right. Now you can check out our website, hsn.com for even additional items, like I was just mentioning a garden hose. If you need one, this Belmont Garden Metal Life Garden Hose really is fantastic. And it's so lightweight, you can easily move around a hundred foot of hose if you need to. It's not like those old green garden hoses that are stiff and they 
and they, you know, kink up and they tear and they, and they, um, you know, rot. These are fantastic. Uh, I love that we've got them, even the larger ones in for you. So the 75 foot or the 100 foot are your options. And those are 0950272 is the number to get those home. And they can obviously fit into any uh, you know, standard size spigot, and then you can take them all the way across the yard or around. Easy for washing your cars and your SUVs and those kinds of things, washing down the uh, walkway. They're fantastic. And we've got those on hsn.com. Okay. Um, this is something that we gave you a sneak peek of uh, earlier on in the show, and a lot of you have already gone in and jumped on it. I am glad that you have. This is the easiest way for you to conceal anything that you don't want seen, um, because this essentially is a fence, but it's not like those regular fences, those chain link fences or those regular, maybe it's like an old picket fence that you just, you know, haven't taken down, um, but it doesn't give you the privacy or the beauty that you want. This does, it's from Improve and it's an expandable fence with leaves. Let me share with you. So you see this, these are your options. We've got it for you in the yellow. This is the purple. Can you see the purple right there on those leaves? We also have it for you in orange on the end. And the one over here is called white. And I saw Guy Yovan do this and I'm gonna do the same way and then we're gonna have all of the presentation. So you can have a, a fence that looks like this or you can have a fence that looks like that. <laughs> Which would you rather have in your home? I would rather have the foliage. And do you see how it's expandable? These are fantastic. Get as many as you need. Let's give you all the details. Deborah Byers is joining us with all of those details. Hi, Tamara. Well, we're going to stave off the rain. Unfortunately, I don't have my market umbrella over me right now. So hopefully it's going to stay dry for a couple of more minutes so I can present how gorgeous this improvements expandable fence is in your yard or garden. I've got it hung up here behind me in the purple and you'd be hard pressed to tell which are the real plants and which is the faux because this gorgeous, gorgeous fence, the expandable fence looks like real leaves. Each one of these gorgeous colors, whichever one of the four that you choose, and I've got the purple back here, all the leaves are variegated. So they blend in with whatever you've got in your garden or in your home. And the expandability gives you the versatility to hide your air compressor or your garbage or your recycling behind something that's absolutely beautiful. And when it comes out of the box, it's going to be two feet by four feet, but then it expands to a full 10 feet, either horizontally or vertically. And it's lightweight. You get 12 zip ties to attach it to whatever you like. So with that chain link fence that you were showing everyone, you could just go ahead and attach it with the, the zip ties that you're getting. Or I've got mine behind me just on hooks. And if you wanted to hang it inside your home, which is another great possibility, you only need one nail because it's, it's so lightweight. But the front is gorgeous with those specially treated leaves that'll protect it from the sun all season long. But the back is real willow wood. So all that expandability comes from real willow wood on the back. So if you're using this as a privacy fence between you and your neighbor, you're going to enjoy the gorgeous leaves on the front. And Tamara, they're not going to be upset because they're going to be able to see this gorgeous willow weed right. read behind. That's so right. it's a win-win for everybody with this amazing fence. It really is. I mean, it can conceal even the most unexpected things like people. <laughs> Look at that. That's awesome. Where did he go? All I see is beautiful foliage. <laughs> So you can do it the tall way, you can do it the long way. This is fun. And, and it just also goes to show, no assembly required. You just open it up, right? You just open it up and spread it out. And if you need a few of these, please go ahead and get them. These are the, these pieces, especially when it does get to be a little bit warmer outside and we've got nicer days outside. These are the kinds of things that sell out so quickly. So you get a chance to jump in and get them first. I love it, um, at, you know, over like a gazebo kind of area if you want 
to conceal that area and give yourself some kind of natural shade. I love this if you, let's say you don't have a big backyard, but you live in an apartment or a condo and you've got a balcony that's open to a garage, you know, a, a parking lot downstairs or other people that can probably see into your balcony. You use this to conceal and now you've got privacy and you feel more com comfortable in those areas. As, you know, as Deborah was saying, real wood, willow wood on the back of these. So there's nothing you have to do except decide where to put it and decide which one to get. This one is yellow and we're talking about the, the beautiful um, kind of variegated colors that are interspersed within the leaves. This is what we're calling yellow. This one is what we're calling purple. And it's not over the top, just a little bit. This one, and these are the, you know, these colors kind of help it to look a little bit more genuine. This is orange, I like that orange. And then over here, we've got it for you in what we're calling white. So it's your choice. Deborah, we're coming back, but these on sale on FlexPay, this is the time to go ahead and do it. Well, there's no question about it, Tamara, and there's a reason why they've been a customer pick season after season. And if you see them now at the beginning of the season, I strongly suggest you pick up your favorite color because they sell out so quickly. And we have had customers, we had one customer last season who bought 30 of them. Wow. And if you have a particular color, now that we have all four of them, either the purple or I've got the white here, which we love, or the yellow or the orange, the colors will all work back to the existing ones that you've already got. So this is a great day to stock up. Now, we all love the look of an ivy-covered cottage, but ivy, you'd have to grow it, you'd have to fertilize it, you'd have to trim it, you'd have to water it, and it can infiltrate the stucco and the siding and the shingles in your home and cause damage. You can have that look on your siding or hide something that's already mm -hmm. cracked on the side of your home with this gorgeous-looking, beautiful fence and use it like a trellis. It'll be ready to go right out of the box. Use it in the front of your home for that area below your porch that has that area where the little critters get in there and create gorgeous curb appeal. So it's so versatile. And if you're up north and it's snowing, I know my nephew's in Buffalo and all he's been doing wow. is shoveling snow. He's got 10 inches of snow. And you're thinking, oh, it's gonna be a long time before I get outside to utilize this. Mm -hmm. Get it now and bring it inside and create that beautiful spring-like feel in your home and just wait for the spring to come. It'll be a great way to get ready for it and then just move it outside or leave it inside because right. it can give you with a little fountain perhaps. You can have a like a little meditation area, but that's how versatile it is to hide something unsightly, to enhance something that you already have and to bring it outside or inside, it's that amazing, Tamara, no question about it. Absolutely, and remember, no assembly required. I love that sentence. <laughs> so there's nothing you have to put together. You don't have to weave anything together. It does come with zip ties. 12 zip ties. So if you want it, if I want it to attach it to this fence, and remember, if you're just joining us, I want to show you when I say fence, I mean, now that's a fence. That's a bare bones fence. That's a, you know, like a chain link fence, right? Um, that is not inviting. It's not beautiful. It's functional, but it's not beautiful. This adds the beauty. That fence may add the function. This adds the beauty and the function. And I can make it as long as my arms will go, or I can pull it in if I only wanted a certain section. Um, and that's that. And then if I want it to stay here, I have it just leaning a little bit, but I would use the zip ties to tie it up and then it's not going anywhere. And now you can't see. It's concealed of what's going on. So if you like to lay out on your balcony or on your deck, and your neighbor is right there and you wanna have something that conceals but doesn't look like a barrier, you know what I mean? Things that are natural like this don't necessarily cause a problem because if I erected a big wall next to me and my neighbor, that might cause a problem. But if I put, you know, just have foliage, it's like, oh, that's very nice just so you can see again the back of it. So if you do have a neighbor that's very close that sees, this is what they see on the back. 
right there. So it looks beautiful from both angles, from both ways. I love these kinds of things. I love these kinds of really easy, simple solutions that I don't have to do much, but they give me such a great look and feel to my area. The sale price is $34, the flex pay is $6.99. How many of them are you going to pick up? Because Deborah, when you were saying that, you know, you were recounting that one of our customers had bought 30 of them, I was thinking, oh my gosh, did they do their entire yard <laughs> with these? <laughs> Can you imagine? I mean, I know I've got all my fencing behind me. I could in fact just go ahead and have an entirely ivy covered no maintenance, no maintenance fence. And if you get the 12 zip ties, which is fabulous, I've got this just hung up on the back wall with hooks. If you want it freestanding, you can go to your home store and get U-shaped stakes and just make it right into the ground and have it stand up straight. But whatever you have, whether it's your pool pump or your, your recycling or your garbage cans or just something that's unsightly, you now have a gorgeous, natural-looking solution that's ready to go right out of the box. And each one of those gorgeous leaves is protected. So it's going to stay the beautiful color that it is that you choose all season long, year after year. And I'm thrilled that we've got them back in stock, Tamara, because they sell out every time. And they're always a customer pick because once you get them home, you realize the versatility and the beauty, whether you use them horizontally or vertically mm -hmm. as so many of you do. It's really, really a great, great thing to start the spring season with. For sure, and this is the time to do it because I know we are coming to, you know, it's February, still a little bit early, but what happens is before you know it, things start to creep up on you and you start to think about all of those different projects or all those different things that you wanna do in your garden or around your home and it starts to become overwhelming, right? But right now you're watching and you're saying, oh, I know exactly where I'm gonna use those. I am gonna use it to cover where the trash cans are or where the air conditioning, you know, uh, compressor is. It's, you know, it's not gonna impede it in any way, but it just blocks it. And if I need to get to it, I just move it out of the way. You're not erecting something that is set in stone that is gonna be an issue if you um, have to get around it. If I need to move this, I literally pick it up and move it out of the way. It weighs like nothing, right? So these are the kinds of things that you have. You know exactly right now where you're going to use them. But once you see how easy it is, you're going to say, you know, I kind of want one over there. And now I want one over there. I think about my mom. She has a shed in her backyard. And it's a nice shed. But if she wanted it to blend in a little bit more with her garden, she could hang these you know, on um, against one of the walls of the shed. And then it looks like an ivy-covered you know, structure back there. It's as simple as that. So which one are you getting? Are you gonna get the white one? Or are you gonna get the yellow? Or the purple? Or the orange? Um, I know a lot of you are calling in for purple. You're seeing the way that Deborah did it and you're loving that purple. And Deborah, I even love that you put these right next to your real genuine plants. And these don't stand out like a sore thumb or uh, of, oh, that's the fake one and those are the real ones. It blends right in beautifully. There's no question. That's why even though it's raining a little bit, I love being out here to be able to show you how natural it looks when you put it in your garden with the real plants. And it doesn't matter which of the four colors you choose. This is the purple. Yesterday I had the yellow. I've got the beautiful orange here. Each one of them is variegated, so the colors are all blended. But remember, you simply right out of the box, it's two feet by four feet, and then it will expand a full 10 feet. So if you've got a narrow, low area, we've got you covered. If you've got a stain on your wall you want to hide, mm -hmm. we've got you covered. If you've got a garbage can you want to hide, we literally have you covered <laughs> with this great expandable fence in whichever one of these four colors you choose. It's really a great day to be able to grab them, Tamara. Definitely. Deborah. thank you so much. Always so good seeing you. Now, Always great to see you, Tamara. No more rain, no more rain. You can go in out of the rain. You can keep shopping for these <laughs> 682301. Go ahead and pick yours up. I'm so glad we have these for you at all colors um, and on sale and on five flex. So enjoy. I will see you again tomorrow. I, I know Bobby's coming up next. She's got another look at our today's special.
Lancome Paris on HSN. Our HSN price is a great value that we bring to you every day. We work hard and have the buying power to make sure it's a value that you'll love. So go ahead, treat yourself with the confidence to buy now at the HSN price. have entered the incredible world of Longcomb, the world's leading French beauty authority.